What's up guys, this is Hardik here and today I'll be showing you how to get Blackberry apps for example Blackberry Hub, the Blackberry services, uh, the Blackberry launcher and everything on any Android device. So as you can see I am here running on Android version 6.0.1 uh, but this will work on uh, the Android versions uh, 5.0 and above so yeah even if it's uh, you are running a custom ROM this will work on that as well so basically the first thing you have to do is just go into the link in the description below that this the cobalt232.github.io I'll be, I'll be giving this link in the description below so don't worry about that the next thing you have to do uh, is just install it and just download and install the Blackbird manager app so this here will be the app itself and once into the app just check for any updates if there are no updates, the first and foremost thing you have to do is just install the Blackberry services. Why I'm saying is there are few apps over here in this list that won't be running without the uh, Blackberry services. So Blackberry services is a must for few apps. So the first thing you have to do is just install the Blackberry services. Then you can install any like any app you want. Uh, and also you can update it from the this app itself the blackberry manager itself so i installed the blackberry hub for example the blackberry launcher the blackberry search the blackberry tasks i quickly show you uh, how the blackberry hub works so as you can see this is the blackberry hub itself and it's linked to my facebook my twitter my text messages as well you can compose it from right over here then as you can see there are a few settings over here I won't be going to settings because a uh, few personal stuff there but basically the Blackberry launcher works fine as well as you can see if I just swipe from over here these are the pop-up widgets Twitter, the Google Chrome and the Play Store for example as you can see everything's wo everything works pretty, pretty fine and as you can see this is the launcher itself going into the launcher settings quickly uh, you can enable and disable each and everything that you want over here then the blackberry device search works fine as well the blackberry tasks work fine just an fyi though after installing blackberry services on few devices after every reboot uh, it will say that blackberry services has stopped but just don't worry about that hit on ok and you're good to go but it only occurs on few devices so don't worry about that also this will probably eat a lot of RAM so if I just go into memory as you can see uh, the RAM is uh, used more uh, than normal so basically that's it and yeah you can even install any app and any APK that you want on your Android device just do one thing go into the about and just grant I'm sorry going to instructions and just grant the device admission administrator permissions and what else it needs just grant it the notification permission set the blackberry launcher as default and yeah that's probably it uh, just do as it says and you're good to go so yeah that's been it guys thank you for watching this video if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and if, if this video helped you or the apks are installed properly also give it a big thumbs up but if it didn't help or if it didn't install just let me know in the comment section below what issues are you facing and i'll be replying you in the comment section below so yeah that's been it uh, i'll see you guys in the next one